This is a piece I've written titled Spirit of America. I want to take you back, oh, 200 years or so, to the birth of a country we all love and know. Destined for greatness and guided by divine design, with four fathers founding from the inspired mind, replacing rule of monarch with a people's republic, restoring rightful freedoms to the hands of the public, established in noble principles, encoded in its seed, made easily available to those that can read. The Declaration and Constitution are truly works of art, written by spiritual men with a surrendered, humble heart. The hand of God moved swift when this country was born to reveal the next step of co-creative living and form. It's about so much more than escape from persecution, inspired men battling for more than just a revolution, putting life on the line to create enlightened institution. The United States is part of human conscious evolution. A national culture birthed for man to reach his potential, designed with principles of truth found to be most essential. Now fast forward to today where everything has changed, freedoms feeling lost and all the systems rearranged. Spirits may feel lonely and the scene looks like all is lost. Yet remember, the fight for freedom is always worth the cost. We stand at the doorway in a new moment of human history, an opportunity to revive the magic of our ancient history, to discover a new level of freedom and sovereign declaration, inspired by the spirit of love without the human expectation. America is the new Atlantis, and she has a great destiny to provide an example of what is possible for humanity. And now the greatest war of all is still yet to come. Only spirit can win that war. May God's will be done. Amen.